Hi, my name is Ivo Steklak. I'm the Chief Technology Officer of EVgo. I'm going to spend a little time with you today talking about EV charging and how that is managed between the dialogue between your vehicle and the charger. Your EV starts, by, starts the conversation by saying what it's capable of. In the case of this EV, it is capable of a peak charging rate of 250 kilowatts, and that is through a combination of just over 800 volts and 310 amps. Charger Evo here is actually capable of 350 kilowatts, and that is through a combination of up to 920 volts and 500 amps. Well, to get things started, we've got to plug our EV into the EV charger. The next part of our dialogue between vehicle and charger is something that we call the safety briefing or safety check. What the charger does is it puts a high voltage signal on the cable and connector leading into the vehicle and it checks for any leakage of that high voltage in the connections within the charger and the connections within the vehicle. If that fails, the charger will immediately stop the charging session and will show an error on the screen or within the mobile application. So now we actually initiate the complicated back and forth between vehicle and charger on the charging session. And so the vehicle starts by basically telling the charger, here's how much current I'm capable of taking right now. The voltage is already set by the vehicle's battery. And we, we know that as we charge our batteries, the voltage goes up. And actually, unfortunately, the current tends to go down as the voltage goes up. Here we have to do, take a little bit of a sidebar and talk about something called the battery management system. The battery management system is basically the brains of your EV's battery. And it does two very specific things. It manages the state of charge or how full the battery is and what is required to get that battery as full as you would like it to be. And state of health. And state of health is the best analogy I can give you is that it is like the fitness coach and your doctor all rolled into one, but taking care of that battery. At an EVgo charger, you can also follow this conversation on the screen of the charger or in the detailed charge session on your mobile app by seeing the state of charge as it completes and watching the voltage go up and the current go down. And there's also a detailed, detailed session screen on the charger that will give you even more information between the vehicle and the charger. So now that my charging session is complete and at EVgo we recommend you fast charge your EV to about 80% state of charge, I can unplug and head off on my merry way.